Carolina wins the tip. McAdoo tips it into the front court to Meeks. He quickly gives it to Tokido. Drives in on an angle from the right and scores. So that didn't take long. About eight seconds into the ball game. Carolina on the board. 17.40 to go first half. 4-2 Notre Dame. Sherman in the paint. Hook shot good as he was able to get it over Meeks. So 6-2 Irish. Just 11 on the shot clock. Atkins dribbles to the right baseline. Caught in the air. Able to swing the floor to Connaughton for three. Notre Dame up nine to two in the first three and a half minutes. Atkins has it now to Sherman. A quick fire hook shot from the left block, no good. Page with the rebound for the heels. He'll push the tempo. Tokido. Nobody ever picked him up in Tokido with a Sports Center highlight. Well, he hit about 10,000 feet in the air at about the uh, block as Page with the long two point jumper off the front iron. No rebound. Tokido crashed the glass, tipped it out to McAdoo. To Page, drives in, floater is good. About 12 feet away, straight away. Page receives the inbound over to Tokido in the left corner. Pump fake for three, comes in a few steps, misses the floater, but Bryce Johnson, all in one motion, catches the rebound and throws it up off the glass for two. Carolina with the turnover. Page, front court, head up right side. He's just gonna stop, pop, and score. The ball went in. Thought about coming out and dropped home. It's a long two-pointer for Marcus Page. Bryce Johnson with the pick. Ends up in Kennedy Meeks' hand. Leaves it for Johnson on the break and lays it in. Good it look a, by Meeks. Yeah, it was a nifty drop by Meeks. And as you heard Coach say in his pregame interview, he's got some of the kind of old man moves. And that time, he just old man moved his way around with Meeks. Meanwhile, Tokido scores in the lane and draws a foul. Page. Front court for the heels. Going to drive on the left. Layup is good. Saw an opening, took it, and Marcus is hurt. Uh-oh. Page slaps the ground. But now he is up. Johnson tips the inbounds, and Page able to chase it down for the steal. Boy, how many times do we see John Henson do that as Page for three to tie the game. Maybe he was lulling them to sleep with the ankle. Connaughton will try to answer. Does not McAdoo with the rebound. I'd really like to see McAdoo right now go after the rim because Austin forget Page Eric for the lead. No, but McAdoo cleans it up with a tomahawk finish. Well, I'll take that in whatever form. I was thinking an offensive move, but an offensive dunk would be just fine also. Notre Dame, Eric goes zone to McDonald. Middle of the floor to Tokido. Page, alley-oop to McAdoo. Comes down with it, back up, and scores. Well, that's a nice way to finish. 27-23, half-court shot. Hit the backboard and the rim, but came out by Eric Atkins. Still outside the arc. McDonald closes in on him. Pass taken away by McAdoo. Stays in the air to push it ahead to McDonald, and he is able to lay it up and in. He'll start the break to Page. Three on two. Leaves it for McDonald. Layup, no. Tokido had the rebound scored out. Meeks cleans it up. Can't finish. Misses again. Third tip up is good, though. Well, Meeks has been all around the basket. Bounce pass to Knight at the free throw line. To forget his pass taken away by Tokido. Open court for JP. Two-handed flush for Tokido. Notre Dame takes a timeout. So the Irish get another possession. Down nine now. Page, though, steals the entry pass. Pushes it front court to McAdoo, and he'll get the right-handed dunk. The Tar Heels with a couple of open court jams this half. 15.34 to go. We'll see Notre Dame, I thought, for a moment in his zone. In fact, they are. McDonald will shoot and score. Three-pointer right sideline. Boy, I tell you, as quick as he shot it, it's a good thing he made it. Atkins drives left of the lane, stumbles, strip, ball loose in the paint. McAdoo comes out of there with it for Carolina. To Page, Page to Johnson, feeling the paint for the jam. I'll tell you, the wheels have really come off of the bus uh, for Notre Dame, and there's a lot of time left. And He'll try to cut into it, transition three, missed by Connaughton. Rebound to Tokido. 11.55 to go, Tokido leaves it for Johnson on the alley-oop, he had to lay it in. Great body control by Johnson to score from the left to McDonald. He'll try a long three. No good. Rebound. McAdoo soars in and finishes from the left. I can't tell you how much I like to see McAdoo when he plays like that. It just hadn't been quite as much when you've got a guy that's a legitimate offensive threat. Page behind a screen for three. Yeah, there's a, there's a legitimate offensive threat. Atkins. Awkward looking shot. No good. Good job by McAdoo on the rebound. And Tokido Page goes up and under. Boy, save that one. That was pretty. 
<laughs> it was really pretty. And 12 seconds on the shot clock as Britt has it still outside the arc. He's just going to knife in the lane, lay it up for two. Nice First points of the, the night for Britt, but two big ones. Notre Dame tried to pick up full court, but left McDonald, who gets the uncontested dunk. McDonald was all alone in the Tar Heel front court. Jackson into the front court will get the layup as the buzzer sounds, but that affects the game in no way. Carolina led two to nothing. Then Notre Dame started hitting everything, but then the Tar Heels roared back and take home a 73-62 road victory.